Um, so I grew up in East London in Leighton, um, in a non-Christian household. Both my parents were atheists. Um, and I grew up, I grew up on the street, as they say. So um, I was a little bit naughty um, through my teenage years. And when I was 16, I started to go to church. But I started to go to church for girls. So I thought the best way to get a girl is to go to church. Um, I'm being honest with you. It's true. Um, <laughs> so, so I started to go to church to look for girls. Obviously, that wasn't the right thing to do. Um, but then I started going weekly, every week. But I was still living a double life. So I was involved in uh, drugs. I used to smoke a lot of weed. I used to drink. I used to have a lot of uh, sexually immoral. So lots of different girls. Um, and I also got involved in quite a lot of street life um, and, and illegal activities. Um, so I was going to church weekly, but still living this double life. Um, when at the age of 19, my life got threatened. Um, I got into a, a situation where it's either life or death. And uh, I dropped to my knees that evening and I cried out to the Lord and I said, if you take me away from this situation, mm. I promise I'll never turn my back on you. Um, that's when I was 19. I'm 38 now mm. and I've been, I've been serving the Lord ever since. Um, I got married at the age of 21. Wow. So I've been married for 16 years mm. to a beautiful Christian woman with three beautiful children. Um, and my children are growing. My eldest son is, is uh, such a blessing. Um, and he, he likes to share the word and evangelize at the age of 13. Wow. So um, so God's really taken me on a journey. I'm not your typical Christian. I don't look like your typical Christian. I don't act like your typical Christian in, in what the world sees it. Um, but yeah, the, the, my aim is just to touch young people and men. I run the men's ministry at our church. Um, so my, my heart is towards young people and men and, and introduce as many men as I can to the Lord Jesus Christ. So yeah, that's me in a nutshell. Um, and that's my testimony. Amen. Thank you.